It was the Badgers ninth game that was decided by five or fewer points and typically that falls in Wisconsin's favor, but Michigan State tonight hit their last eight shots to surge ahead and Wisconsin now has dropped back to back games in the Big Ten. Coach Greg Gard said it came down to a lack of execution on both ends of the floor and the last 10 possessions that made the difference tonight. What the Badgers can take away from the loss, their bench looked much improved from Saturday's loss to Illinois. The bench combining for 20 points tonight compared to seven against Illinois. You know, the four minutes at the start of the game um, and the four minutes at the end, you know, and as I told the team, it's unfortunately it's 40 minutes, not 32. So we've got to find a way to continue to be a more complete team at the start and at the end. I'm encouraged by what I've seen from some of the guys that are getting better um, that aren't maybe in the main rotation that are working their ways and, and it's going to help us as time goes on. And as for Tyler Wall, Greg Gard said there's no timetable for his return. It is encouraging that he wasn't in a boot tonight. Gard said he checks in with him every day. He seems to be getting better day by day, but still is unsure if he's going to play in Saturday's game against Indiana. Tom Izzo opened his press conference by acknowledging what a loss that is for Wisconsin, calling him a glue guy and one of the best players in the league. At the Cole Center, Leo Doherty, NBC 15 Sports.